the resultant of two forces one and p is perpendicular to one and equal to one then the value of p and angle between the forces is here two forces first force is one and the second force is p the resultant of these two forces is equal to one and this resultant is perpendicular to one and in this question we have to calculate the value of p and angle between the forces to solve this question diagram is very very important given forces F1 is equals to 1 and the second force P. Resultant of these two forces is equals to 1. The main condition in this question resultant and one of the force that is 1. These two are perpendicular to each other. First force acting along this direction. And take the second force in the same order. It is acting along this direction. And the resultant of these two forces. This one. Perpendicular to first force. Along this direction. 1 is acting. And along this direction P is acting. And the resultant is acting along this direction. This diagram is look like right angle triangle. Hypotenuse and these two are sides. P square is equals to 1 square plus 1 square. Why? Because resultant is equals to 1. Then P is equals to square root of 1 plus 1, 2. So P value is root 2. Now we want angle. This vector acting along this direction head part and uh, this is tail part. So angle between these two vectors exterior angle. So let this angle be theta. Now from this triangle tan theta is equals to opposite side by adjacent side. Opposite is 1. And adjacent is 1. 1 by 1 is equals to 1. Then theta is equals to 45 degrees. And now let it be alpha. Theta plus alpha is equals to 180 degrees. Then alpha is equals to 180 minus theta. 180 minus 45. That is equals to 135 degrees. P value is root 2 and angle between the given two vectors is equals to 135 degrees. Check the given options. First option is correct.